Okay. Hello, everybody. This is a 2013 Chrysler 300C John Varvatos Edition 64 of 2000. And I'm going to show you really quick how I was able to enable the SRT package in this standard Chrysler 300C Hemi V8. As you can see, nothing up my sleeve, nothing on the dashboard here that uh, shows anything SRT. This is like straight out of the factory. Uh, nothing in the center cluster. Okay, got it. Okay, so I'll show you the cable that I used uh, that I got on Amazon and uh, connected USB to my laptop. And this is the program that I'm using. It's called Multi ECU Scan. Uh, it could be purchased from multi ECU scan.net. And if you don't know how to do it, it can be tricky, but I'll show you really quick. All right. This is what I chose. I chose Chrysler. And it'll probably work exactly the same way if you have a Dodge. I couldn't get it to work for a Dodge, but since this is a Chrysler, this is what I did. I selected Dodge. Over here, I selected Therma 3.0 Multijet 16V. Go down to Body. I selected Body. Over here, I selected Body Computer Morelli. And mind you that I did have to put the ignition in the run position for it to communicate to the ECU. So after I selected Body Computer Morelli, went down to Connect, Connect in the ECU. All right, inside here, I went all the way to the right, Adjustments. Now, mind you, this is disabled at the factory if this is not a SRT model. They're all disabled. So right here, SRT vehicle. Click to highlight it. And I mean, literally, I'm showing you how to do this, but it really takes like 30 seconds to get it done. Click execute. Read all notes. Yes. Right there, it's telling me SRT mode is not present. So you're going to select it. And you're going to click present. Okay. Please confirm. Yes. And progress completed. So I can show you right now at the dash, I already have my SRT enabled. I have my options here. SRT. Tanya was not there before. I got all the options in the dashboard that will work. Let me move the car and show you the G-forces do work. Okay. Now this part, to get to the radio, you have to go back up to SRT performance screens. It's telling you right here, this function allows to activate, deactivate the SRT menu and screens in the Uconnect system. Got it. I'm going to go down to execute. Please read all the notes. Yep, there's no notes. Got it. Right there, it's telling me not present. Click the drop down, say present. Okay, please confirm. Yes, in progress. Completed. All right, this is the part where it's not gonna be automatic. You actually have to click yes, turn the vehicle to off, take your key fob, take it out of the car, Close your door. Make sure it's not in the car. Okay. No key fob detected. Let your car chill out for a minute. Let it kind of turn off, reset. Give it about 30 seconds to about a minute at the most, right? Now, I can't guarantee if you have a 2020 model, this is going to work. Can't guarantee it's going to work in the V6 models, but I can say that... Uh, it worked on my car, 2013 Chrysler 300 with just a Hemi engine, all right? So I give it about uh, 10 more seconds here, and I think that should be good. So I just took, put my key fob underneath my car. Got it back in. Put it to run. John Barbados. Whoa, hello, welcome back.
SRT performance. Okay, so what you get, you get your timers. You can't select everything, right? This is not a demo. This is actual G-Force. Sit in the car, shaking. There you go, G-Force is moving. Gauge is one, that's what you get, oil. Oil temp, oil pressure, battery voltage. You also get gauges two, get all these, you get the engine. Shows you uh, what gear you're in, speedometer, handling, G-Force, and options. You can pick your color. Of course, my car is a black John Ravados. So yes, got that. And there you have it. So I'm done with the computer. So I will disconnect the cable and show you that this is actually the cable that I bought from Amazon. It is an ELM 327, uh, supports all ODB, OBD2 protocols. So I didn't get the Bluetooth option. It's just a standard cable, USB laptop. Buy the program for, I think it was like 35 bucks. Got the cord for about 15 bucks on Amazon. So I would say give or take after taxes. Paid maybe less than $55. So I enabled this, uh, I would say about four years ago uh, and just rejoined Facebook again. Just wanted to share the knowledge, let everybody know that you can do it. Go back into the factory modes and turn SRT back on. If you got any questions, please let me know.